Come back from a really nice day of diving. Boats back in the lagoon, and the other guys are just tidying up and um, offloading the fish. We had a really good day. Um, yesterday, while Barrett was doing a drift with his camera and his gun, um, he came across a, a section of reef with a shoal of punsies on. Um, because he had the gun and camera with him, he couldn't get a shot in. So we decided to come back today to the same place. We dropped the guys off in shallow, and he and I just um, bombed that section of reef. Uh, the current had swung, it was from the south now, which actually improved conditions on that section. The fish were more concentrated. So we started diving from the northern end of it, on the sand first, and we saw the punsies there, but they wouldn't come off the, the top of the pinnacle. So we did a couple of dives moving closer and closer. Dived on the top, they came in a bit closer, but we're still a bit wary. So then we decided to dive down in a gully and see if us being below them would um, make a difference. And sure enough, one came right in, Got a shot at it through the head and landed that one. We really came down here to see if we could dive in the sardine shoals, but um, it, it is a good area for reef fish and, and well known um, for punsies in this area. They tend to be a little bit shallower, it seems, than, than up in the tail. So these ones that we were hunting today were only in about 11 to 13 meters, that sort of depth. And it's very seldom that you get them in that depth up in the tail. Very clever fish. You have to work out the way they're thinking to, um, to shoot them. Uh, you, you have to be still on the bottom for a long dive before they'll approach you. After we, we landed these fish, we re reviewed the, the dives on our Sunto computers, and um, we were doing between a minute and a half and a minute and three quarter dives to, to land those ones.
We saw Selfish jumping, so <laughs> Garrett jumped in the water and he's got himself a Selfish. Wonderful, there goes the boy and the gun. Jump, jump one. Come in the water here with Garrett, he shot himself a Selfish, putting on a bit of a fight. Trying to get closer to land him. Giving us a good pull, man. Unbelievable, man. It's awesome. In the trans car, a sale of about 40 kilos. Unreal. That's the other side, Garrett. Garrett, you want to get out the water? There's a big shark here. Like a proper one. Garrett, what was that? Unreal, man. Thanks, Guy. Thanks, Barry. We've been having a great day. Water's been very, very cold. We've had a bit of visibility. Um, just driving back to one of our last spots and came across that fish jumping. I'm not sure what it was doing. They jumped like that to sell fish. Dropped beautifully in front of it. What a treat here on the trans car. That's from that uh, famous movie, I Think We're Gonna Need a Bigger Boat. A big shark came to eat this thing, eh? Very big shark. We're on the trans car. <laughs> what do you uh, think the weight of that is? 40 kilos. It's a very quick decision. Have a look. It's a moose, eh? Beautiful one. <laughs> so happy. Well, we have an awesome day of diving out here in the trans car. We're gonna head home, cook ourselves a little bit of dinner. We're gonna do it all again tomorrow. Hope you've enjoyed it. It's all for now.